Hi, I'm Patrick Harders. I'm one of the co-founders of Sterling Lighting. This fixture here is one of the fixtures I am most proud of, one of the great fixtures we've designed, and has really had a great impact on our business and the people who choose to use this product. It is far superior to any other path light out there. There are so many small details we have done in this fixture to make it a higher quality fixture that I just want to take a moment and go through some of them so that you can see the thought process and the quality that went into this fixture. Every time I go up to meet with a customer, I will always put this fixture in the customer's hand and let them hold it. Most of the time they sit there and they hold this fixture for a while because it's so heavier. It's, it's so much heavier than what they're expecting. And especially if they've had other lighting companies out and they feel that fixture, versus the competition. This is just such a beefier, stronger fixture. And so we're trying to design lighting systems that not only look beautiful, but also last a lifetime. This fixture does come with a 10 foot wire lead. This allows us to connect multiple fixtures together so we have less connections. We don't have any tack welds. Most of the path lights out there are simply tack weld together, a couple spot tacks that hold the fixture together. Every piece of ours is threaded. So this could thread loose or thread up and what this does it gives a lot more strength to the fixture when i'm installing this light some people think that this light is tall or big and it's really not in my opinion you may disagree with me but when my local company installs this fixture we actually install the abs stake in the ground and we come up another four inches so we're getting about 14 inches into the ground one thing I hate is path light tops that fall off or leaning fixtures. You'll see a lot of the quality path lights are real heavy up top or real heavy down low. We have a great central balancing point of this fixture so that way it stays straight much longer with a lot less issues. I have the path light top that simply threads off. If something were to ever happen, this is very easy to change any of these components out. So even if a little kid came up and hit this, hit this with a baseball bat, we could replace the lens very easily, put in a new lens, and the customer is happy, the fixture looks good as new. This is what our LED looks like. We do not believe in using those little corn cob five pin bulbs. There's too many problems. There's just again, there's not enough place for that heat to go. We spread the light output with this dome that we've created. What this does, it also gets rid of hot spots. We design lighting systems that the path lights are up a hill. And when you come at the bottom of the hill, you're looking up into the path light, you see light glare, and I hate light glare. I also don't like to see the arms that so many companies put onto the, hold the base of the fixture to the path light top, because it creates line and lines in my lighting design. I like a nice, perfect, clean design. So we designed our lens to simply thread in to the fixture. If you ever need to change out the LED, if there were ever a problem, which we have sold thousands of these fixtures and we have very few that have ever had an issue, but it's simply unscrew the LED, unplug it, plug a new one in, thread it back in, and you're good as new. So this is a fixture that really you should have in your arsenal. This will help you sell more projects because people will see the quality of the fixture, they see the classic design, and when they hold it in their hand, they understand that they're getting a much better fixture and a much better lighting system than they can get anywhere else.